We've got fishing rod with a bit of fish on it. I'm going to feed some crocodiles. Sean here from the amazing city of Ho Chi Minh. Today we're doing the Mekong Delta Tour. All right, let's do it. Welcome to Vietnam. <laughs> Hello. Hi, Joe. 100%. So, as part of the Mekong Delta River Tour today, we've got a big boat tour that we're going to go on, small boat river tour. We're going to check out a coconut candy factory. There's lunch at a restaurant, there's some folk music quite a bit in store so make sure you stick around so join us as we go on the Mekong River Tour. The tour includes pick up and drop off from your hotel in Ho Chi Minh City. At the Vin Train Pagoda, our first stop on the Mekong Delta River Tour today. Let's check it out. on the first boat tour so this is the bigger boat and then we'll be going on a smaller rowboat after check it out So we just stopped at the honeybee royal jelly place. They do a lot of royal jelly honey here and normal honey as well as other snacks. They do a ginger honey snack, the banana honey snack and they do a really good honey lemon tea as well. This is 
banana soaked in the royal jelly. So this is the honey lemon tea. It's really good. It's like it's got that really nice honey taste. Not too sweet. The lemon breaks it down quite a bit. And then they've got some barley in it too to add a bit of a, a more mellow taste to it. It's really good. Mm. And then this here is just some royal jelly. Mm. So it's royal jelly honey. It's quite sweet. It's a bit mellow. It's quite nice though. It's really good. Definitely worth checking out this place. It's good. So this is the ginger snack. Mm. Dried ginger always has that really strong taste. You almost want to use it in something to cook rather than snack on it. It's really good though, just really strong in flavour. Mm. It's good. So we just stopped at the third stop here for some fruit, tea and some folk music. Jungle climate similar to Indonesia, Malaysia and also Thailand. So the tropical fruits here really do have that really nice flavour. That's quite good. There's five different fruits. So we've got pineapple, watermelon, long end, guava and dragon fruit. All really nice.
was the riverboat tour. Pretty cool, actually. The highlight of the trip so far. So we just stopped at the coconut candy factory. Let's check it out. Without the machine, they just keep half of the coconut shell like that and they put inside a tool to make a powder. And after put inside the machine, they had a powder. <laughs> This is 100% of milk. If they cook, only cook with milk. You know, they cook like that, they're just a uh, whole thing for the flavor, tasty. They will mix with the ginger, chocolate, or peanut, all right, or only coconut, or durian. They wrap candy uh, with two layers. They had this snake liquor we just had to try. Hundred percent. How it is so tonight you will happy. So this is the Vietnamese version of the tuk tuk. What is it? at a restaurant now we're about to stop for lunch so come along let's do it just next to where we stopped for lunch there is this crocodile pit got fishing rod with a bit of fish on it I'm gonna feed some crocodiles. All right, let's do it. After feeding the crocodiles, it was time to venture back. The island that we spent most of our time in that you saw today was Unicorn Island. Pretty nice place, a lot of activities. There's actually four islands you can visit here though. So there's Dragon Island, Phoenix Island, Unicorn Island, one other island I can't remember the name of right now.
still got a lot coming up from Vietnam as well. We're gonna do the monthly wrap up, monthly living costs, what's it like to be in Ho Chi Minh City. So a lot to come from Vietnam. And as you probably already know, if you've seen the suit video, if you haven't, go check that out because I'm heading back to Australia soon and I've got a mate's wedding to go to. So a few more videos coming from Australia. If that sounds good to you, make sure you hit the like, hit that subscribe button if you haven't subscribed already. If you have, thank you. We do appreciate the support and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.